Yes, I do. Thank you. Thank you very much. You, uh, I don't know if you've heard the earlier uh, testimony or not, but we use a, a timing system. Thank you for the invitation to appear before you today. The people who were coming to us for risk in the housing market wanted to have a security that gave them exposure to the housing market, and that's what they got. The unfortunate thing, and it's unfortunate, but it doesn't, is that the housing market went south very quickly after some of these securities, not all of them, because someone were done early, but they went, and so people lost money in it, but the security itself delivered the specific exposure that the client wanted to have. You don't believe it's relevant to a customer of yours that you are selling a security to that you are betting against that same security. You just don't think it's relevant and needs to be disclosed. Is that the bottom line? Yes, and the people who are selling it in our firm wouldn't even know what the firm's position is. Um, there must be. I haven't, I, never, I haven't reviewed the records. Would you have your staff provide that to us? Sure. If you would, please. You are taking a position against the very security that you are selling, and you are not troubled. Senator, as I, again. And you want people to trust you. Senator, I think people. Why would trust people. Us. I won't trust you. If you came to me and wanted to sell me securities and you didn't tell me that you have a bet against that same security, Senator. You, think, you don't think that affects my Senator. thinking? We have spent a lot of time going through all these documents. And let me just explain in very simple terms what synthetic CDOs are. They are instruments that are created so that people can bet on them. It's the la-la land of ledger entries. It's not investment in a business that has a good idea. It's not assisting local governments in building infrastructure. It's Gambling, pure and simple, raw gambling. At Washington Mutual, with market-driven credit rating agencies. We, we did not cause the financial crisis, specifically to the mortgage desk, which is what I'm here to speak about. You have two panels in subsequent meetings to, to speak about that, uh, about the Goldman Sachs and our businesses. Um, we, I do not think that we did anything wrong. Thank you, Senator Pryor. Senator Ensign. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. This is an incredibly important hearing. 